Hello, in this video I'm going to be going over how you can create metahumans in the latest version of Unreal Engine, version 5.6. To get started, we just want to go over to your Epix Games Launcher, go over to your Unreal Engine version 5.6, then you just want to go here, go over to Options, and make sure that you have the metahuman creator core data enabled. Once you've done that, just click Apply, and then launch your Unreal Engine 5.6 project. Then, in your Unreal Engine project, you just want to enable the metahuman plugin. To do that, go over to Edit, then plugins, then in the search, look for MetaHuman, and you just want to check this MetaHuman creator, it's in beta, select yes, and then you'll just need to restart your Unreal Engine project so that the plugin can take effect. Then once you've done that, you should be able to create MetaHumans. So to do that, you can just right click, then go to MetaHuman, and select MetaHuman character. I'll double click and open this up. And now I have the option to create my MetaHuman. We can use these tabs in the left to customize our MetaHuman. It even comes with some presets, so if you want your character to look like one of these presets, you can just select them. But I can just go to my body. We can basically, um, if you've used the original MetaHuman creator, we can basically drag in, let's say, three bodies. And then, if say I click on one of these um, arrows, I can make my character's neck look like Cameron's neck by just clicking here, and then, um, moving it here, so it kind of looks like Cameron's neck. If I change the size of these, I'll make these bigger. If, say, I want my character's head to be more like bows, I can just drag this up. I can also just select the model, and then I can also just adjust these sliders here if I want to adjust how my character will look. I can do the same thing with their head. I can choose their skin color. Here, I can customize all of their hair settings and the clothes that they wear. And then, just so I have a finished MetaHuman, I'm just going to select one of the presets. And then, once you've finished designing your MetaHuman, what you need to do is you just need to rig them. So, to do that, we can just click here, create full rig. Okay, so it's finished rigging my character. After you've rigged your character, we just need to download their textures. To do that, we just need to go over here, download texture source. And I'm just going to select download 2K resolution textures. Then once we've done that, we can just go over to assemble. And then here we can basically um, export our MetaHuman character into our game project. Here under the assembly, we can choose the quality that we want our MetaHuman to be. So UE Cine, I think it's for like cinematic projects. UE Optimized, I think it's for like game projects if you want to use it in your games. UEFN Export is for like if you're using it for Unreal Engine Editor for Fortnite. And then DCC Export is if you're exporting the MetaHuman to some external software. So I'm just going to select UE Optimized because I want to use this in my game. I'll leave the quality at high. And then I'm just going to assemble this guy. Okay, so it's finished creating my MetaHuman. Your MetaHuman should just be in this folder, MetaHumans. And now we have a MetaHuman character we can use in our game. That's all for this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.